Welcome back. Thanks for staying with us on this cold Friday night and even colder weekend. It's a first alert weekend for potentially dangerous wind chills. A live look now from our Georgia Southern Sky Cam in Statesboro. I'm first alert meteorologist Jamie Ertle. 38 in Statesboro feels like freezing. 42 in Savannah feels like 37 and etc. As we head into the evening, 41 Hinesville, 45 Jessup. So we haven't plunged necessarily and we won't be as cold tomorrow morning morning as we will coming up Sunday. So 35 at midnight feels like 28. Then that hard freeze as we head through the overnight hours. Hard freeze means a prolonged period of freezing and sub freezing temperatures. 28 at 7 a.m. in Savannah feels like 21 and take a look at the feels like temperature at 11 a.m. Still feels like freezing because we have that breeze 10 to 15 out of the northwest throughout the day. Fair and fair first alert live radar on a slow sweep, but it will start to get some action in about four days heading into next work week and it'll stay pretty active through the end of the work week. We have a wind chill advisory Saturday night into Sunday morning at 10 a.m. for most of the coastal empire and low country minus Tombs and Montgomery counties, but it still will be bitterly cold. Take a look at the potentially dangerous wind chills on our Sunday with a morning low of 19 in the borough. It may feel like 10, 22 in Savannah may feel like 11 and it may even feel like the teens on Tyvee. Heading out the door tomorrow morning, bundle up 25 in the borough, 27 Jessup, freezing on Hilton Head and Tybee, and here's what it feels like city by city. Teens basically west of I-95, but 21 in Savannah. That's what it's going to feel like, and it's going to feel like 23 on the islands. Again, the feels like temperature, the wind chill will be in play pretty much all day. 11 a.m., 39 feels like freezing. 46 at 2 feels like 40. 44 at 5 feels like 39, and we plunge again. So please be aware of that throughout the day. It's not a layer up type of day. It's an all day coat type of day. 46 for the high in Jessup, 45 Statesboro. Our afternoon highs this time of year should be about 41. So these are closer to our morning lows. 45 for the high in Hampton, 47 in Beaufort, 44 on Hilton Head. A morning frigid temperature. That's why we have first alert and again, I just wanted to show you the possibility. This is another model showing that we could see single digits in a couple of cities. Feels like temperatures Sunday morning. It could feel like eight in the borough. It could feel like eight in Estill and still pretty frigid heading out the door Monday. So don't let your guard down at the bus stop or if you have to defrost your car Monday morning. Then a rapid warm up from 44 for the high on Sunday to 65 Tuesday, mid 70s Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, potentially even warmer but some unsettled weather kind of rolling in from the Gulf and from the West. So some morning showers, some afternoon showers. I'm keeping it at 30% right now. It doesn't look like a deluge any one day, but it does look like a good chance of rain throughout the next work week. Thanks, Jamie.